Hi folks, thanks for joining me once again today with my short and sweet e-liquid reviews. You've seen them before, you know they're short and sweet. Now, if you've just seen recently, I've done a review of a limited edition Dispergo-based e-liquid. But Dispergo have done something pretty cool and something unique. They've kind of collaborated with other e-liquid manufacturers and made a limited edition line. Some of them are Dispergo brands, but some of them are from other manufacturers. Super good being one... Oh, there's another one I keep forgetting. And then there's this one, which is fruit. Now, if you haven't heard of fruit e-liquid, they basically make a lot of different fruit-based e-liquid flavours. Some of them are quite unusual, though. Some really unusual fruits. It's not like they just got, you know, apple and pears and made an apple pear. No, they use all sorts of exotic flavours. They've done quite a few interesting ones, actually. Fruit, very well known. A leading brand. It says it on here, anyway. Leading brand, limited edition flavours. I think it's really cool, this burger, doesn't it? Anyway, this one... This one actually is quite a simple flavour, really. Pineapple and grapefruit. But nonetheless, I'm interested to see what... I don't really understand what it's all about, and I don't even know how many of these limited edition bottles are going to be available. So if you are interested in these things, you have to be quick, because I, I, I don't know how long they're going to last. They're limited edition. I would say there are 100ml bottles, obviously space in there for your two uh, two Nick shots. And they're all nice, black and gold. And I don't know how well you can see it, but you've got this cool, like, crackled effect on here. It's really nice. Nice nice looking bottles. Pretty smooth. So I've got that juice in the Hellbeast RDA on top of the fingerprint magnet, 100 watts. A set of uh, proper coils in there. 0.16 air flows, kind of two-thirds open. Let's give it a little bash. You know when you like you like the taste of pineapple but you don't like the sharpness does that make sense it makes sense in my head it's like if you have a pineapple juice i like pineapple juice juice pineapple juice mm -hmm. pineapple juice but there's a acidicness to it afterwards that i just it just annoys me i want just the pine just get the actual pineapple flavor pluck that out that's what i want that's what this is. Really, really nice pineapple. And I think it's probably got something to do with the way the grapefruit is. Now, grapefruit is kind of like pineapple in a way. Because, it, again, I don't like grapefruit to eat. I don't like the taste of it. It's too, like, I don't know what it is. But, however, it does something really good with the pineapple here. It makes it just that sweet pineapple flavour. And then that grapefruit just kind of adds to it, but removes that acidicness that I just don't like. It reminds me a little bit of Lilt, but Lilt, again, I find Lilt a bit acidic-y, a bit too strong and tart and sharp. This has got kind of a bit of tartness to it, because you've got that pineapple still, but this is a really, really nice, fresh, fruity, definitely a very good summer flavour. This is quite sweet. Maybe slightly too sweet for me all day, every day. Um, I wouldn't say it's overly sweet, sickly sweet, but just for me as an all-dayer, a tiny bit too sweet now fortunately you could put in your two nick shots in there and that will dilute the flavor slightly uh probably dilute that sweetness a little bit uh oh and there's actually there's a tiny bit of cooling to it like a tiny amount i can just i just felt it then when i'm breathing in yeah the smallest amount you just feel it ever so slightly but again i didn't notice it until i did that so yeah tiny bit of cooling anyway like i said you could dilute this slightly if you didn't want so much sweetness which obviously you probably are going to dilute it because you can put two nick shots in this this is a really nice, fresh, fruity flavour. Just for me, a little bit too sweet, but still, the pineapple has been really nicely nailed. Probably, I think because of the way the grapefruit's done. That, yeah, that's a that's one of the best pineapple-based flavours I've tried, actually. Just a tiny bit too sweet. So I hope this helpful, folks, was. Hit the plus button here on Rumble. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You can see me every Friday night on YouTube. Flat Caps Fridays, 9pm. Massive thanks to Dispergo for sending this over for you. I'm Flag of Vapor. Thanks for watching.